In this video we're going to put latitude and longitude together. If you're not sure about latitude or longitude, you should watch the earlier videos which explain each of those. The equator, which is at zero degrees latitude, divides the world into two hemispheres. We get a northern hemisphere and a southern hemisphere. We can see this here on this map where we end up having a northern hemisphere and a southern hemisphere. The prime meridian which runs through Greenwich divides the world up and gives us an eastern hemisphere and a western hemisphere. And these two lines together divide the world up into four quadrants. So we have here a southeastern hemisphere, and Australia is in the southeastern quadrant. And we can see up here North America, the United States, is in the northwestern hemisphere. Or the northwestern quadrant, meaning that it is in both the northern and in the western hemispheres. Latitude and longitude are used to locate places on the globe. When we use latitude and longitude to do this, we first write the latitude of a location and then we write the longitude of the location. And we always make sure that we show whether it is a north or a south latitude and an east or a west longitude. Here's an example of how we would write a location. If we had a place that was 40 degrees to the north of the equator and then 80 degrees to the west of the equator, we would write it as 40 degrees north, 80 degrees west. And this would be a place on the east coast of the United States of America. We can see just by looking at this writing that the location is going to be in the northern hemisphere and in the western hemisphere. This second location is obviously a place which is in the southern hemisphere and also in the eastern hemisphere. And it is 30 degrees to the south of the equator and 125 degrees to the east of the prime meridian. And this is a place in Australia. There's over 100 kilometres between each line of latitude. So if I was on a ship and I said I'm at 41 degrees north, there's quite a bit of distance between 41 degrees and 42 degrees. So 41 degrees north by itself is not very accurate. So each degree is broken down further into what we call minutes and seconds. And these things will be discussed in the next video.